Did you know your kiddo can play like a devil? Yes, hockey with the New Jersey Devils, all through an affordable and super cute program around the state. I'm Marissa with NJ Mom, and we are giving you an inside look right here from the Prudential Center. How old are you, Chase? Six. And what are some of the things that you like doing best when you're out there playing? Hitting the puck. What's the hardest part about playing hockey? Shooting it in the net. Getting the goal, right? Yeah. So this is the Learn to Play program presented by RWJ Barnabas Health. And these are new players who come out for an eight-week program and they learn amazing skills to become a better hockey player. Tell me a little bit about like what's he, what he's learned over the course of that. How, how has he developed? Uh, he's really improved his skating. Being able to skate with a stick was a big step, obviously. And For a five-year-old, yeah. yeah. Yeah, this is his first time skating with equipment, so he's gotten comfortable with that. We've had a long-standing relationship with the New Jersey Devils. They handle all the on-ice skills of skating and, and stick handling. We do everything else, so we'll do a dynamic warm-up. We'll provide nutrition information and concussion information and sports performance information and all of that education it's really important not just for the kids but for the parents as well. You guys ready to have fun? Yeah. yeah! All right so we're gonna do some stretches. All right can we do some big circles guys and they're gonna slowly come down to your toes. All right good chase NJ say give me that fuck NJ. They go from like a really a learn to skate where they're so unorthodox like being Bambi on skates which is natural normal to now look at them. They're chasing us around, they're, 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 they're drawing penalties now, which is really quite, quite cool, because they're, they're being creative. Such a great introductory program, especially with partners like the NHL, the NHLPA, USA Hockey, and, and RWJ Barnabas Health, to really give these families the best experience possible with the game of hockey. Obviously, every kid, they fall down, they get right back up. It's, it's good to see him once he does hit the ice, he gets right back up, he knows he doesn't get discouraged. He can go through the whole rundown of the Devils, he knows everybody on the team. He, he tells me how to play this game. So it's, it's great just listening to his joy in it and how he, you know, how he just loves it. It was a good way to get him with professionals and also get a lot of the equipment and have fun. I mean, the little ones and the, all the equipment, I can't. I know. So. <laughs> Today it's not enough just to learn how to skate. You really need that full array of, of information uh, to help you just be and live a healthier, active lifestyle. My mom had to go through it as a kid. She's the biggest and best supporter I've ever had in my life. And I was able to do all these fun things that these kids are doing now, so it's great. What advice do you have for younger moms as their kids get involved in sports, find something they're excited about, for really, you know, supporting them? Because you've done that all these years. Right, just let them enjoy the journey. Because not all of them want to do it next year, maybe. Let them have the fun they're having now. Some are going to do better than others. Some are going to hate it. Some are going to be in the NHL. And some may just make it. That journey is, is theirs to have, not ours. Ready on three. Ready, one, two, three. Yeah. Yeah.